Thanks for joining us tonight. A major crash on the Atchafalaya Basin Bridge caused a four-hour standstill this afternoon for travelers. The delay creating an inconvenience, but also a safety concern for many of the people stuck in the 100 degree heat. Yes, it was a hot one. News 10's Britt LaFaso shows us how drivers coped and she tells us what the Highway Safety Commission says about this reoccurring traffic problem. Britt. You can see here how some people spent their time while they were stuck for four hours. In true Louisiana fashion, these people resorted to fishing in the basin. And while some had a little fun, others were worried about getting dropped on the bridge with these heat indices up to 115 degrees. If I stood out here for any much longer, I will be out of gas. That was a big concern for many people stuck on the bridge. If, I mean, if someone was low on fuel, I felt sorry for it for them, you know, they had to turn their car off as they ran out. It was very, very hot. And that's what many people decided to do. Dozens turned off their vehicles, pulled out their fold-up chairs and umbrellas, and set up shop for the afternoon. They didn't expect, however, to be trapped on the bridge for so long. I wasn't expecting a four-hour wait, nor was I prepared for a four-hour wait. <laughs> Greg Fisher with the Louisiana Highway Safety Commission says that's exactly what you have to do. Prepare. You know, having gas in your car before you go, uh, checking your Freon. Might be smart to grab a, a glass of water on your way out the door and stuff, stuff like that. He says most times, especially on the Basin Bridge, there's just no way of diverting standstill traffic if there is a major crash. And yes, you are inconvenienced if you're sitting on a bridge for four hours, but up in the front of that, line somebody is seriously injured and somebody is potentially killed in a car crash so to keep that into perspective and know that law enforcement is working on it you know our ems is you know our ambulance workers are up there trying to help uh, these people uh, that that got into the crash as for the dangerous heat you may find yourself stuck in Fisher says never to leave a child in a vehicle without AC, even if it's just for a few minutes. He also says to look out for one another. Ask your neighbor if you need something. First of all, don't be afraid to say, hey, I got a kid in the car. My AC is not working. You know, can I have some help or something like that? Um, you know, of course, you have to come together in times of crisis. According to AAA, they're expecting record traffic this 4th of July weekend as gas prices are a dollar cheaper than last year. So if you're going to be traveling across the Basin Bridge, the best advice from officials is to be prepared if you do get stuck. Britt LaFosso, Caleb Y, News 10.